Hi everyone, welcome to today's Friday Focus from a very cold and snowy Essex. Today we're going to have a look at the Clam Cleat 253 cleat, which is available in this anodised colour and also the silver, which we're going to look at in a bit more detail. So this is traditionally used for trapeze systems, which I've set this up with a bit of rope to show how that works, and also for kickers or vangs in, uh, in dinghy so you can tighten that up. What the 253's got is it's got a hole in the bottom to secure rope, a hole in the top, you've got the traditional clam cleat teeth here which support three to six millimeter ropes in this in this version and also it's got a roller on the back as well which makes the rope go up and down a lot more easily. So if we think about a trapeze system your trapeze wire or dyneema would come off the top here it would go up to the top of your mast. Your trapeze hook would traditionally be on this bit of rope here. What the 253 does is it makes it easy so if you're hooked on because the roller's there, it makes it a lot easier to pull yourself up with a lot less friction. So you can pull up, cleat, and when any weight goes back down on it, if you're on the trapeze, it grips in again. And to pull it out with any clam cleat, just give it a bit of pressure, lift it up, and it comes out again. Really, really popular. Obviously, we stock them in the two colours, the anodised or the silver for your boat. Most traditionally, trapeze cleats. Um, it also comes with this PT link as well, which I haven't put on at this point, but a lot of people put this um, put this in between the ropes to help guide the rope and keep it connected. So you can see this is springing out here, but you might want to put that between there to hold the lines to get a better run. If you've got any questions about the Clam Cleat 253 or any of our other Clam Cleat products, get in touch with the team at Sailing Chandlery. We're always happy to help.